Hello everyone, welcome to Route to Mathematics. In this video, we are going to solve an logarithm based question. So, the given question is A, B are positive integers if log base 9 of A equals to log base 12 of B equals to log base 16 of A plus B, then find the value of B by A. So, here we have given logarithm equation. From this, we are asked to find the value of B by A. So, without any delay, let's start the solution. So, we have one and only equation that is log base 9 of A equals to log base 12 of B equals to log base 16 of A plus B. Let all this be equal to a constant K. So, from here we can write log base 9 of a equals to k. So, we know a logarithm law that is x to the power n equals to a means log base x of a equals to n. Okay. So, by applying this logarithm rule, we can write this as a equals to 9 to the power k. Let it be equation 1. Similarly, we can write log base 12 of b equals to k. So, by applying same logarithm rule, we can write b equals to 12 to the power k. Let it be equation 2. And also, we have log base 16 of a plus b equals to k. So, this can be written as a plus b equals to 16 to the power k. Let it be equation 3. So, in the next step, let's just divide b in the both side of equation 3. So, what we are getting is a by b plus 1 equals to 16 to the power k by b. So, let's just take a by b equals to m. So, our equation becomes m plus 1 equals to 16 to the power k. And from equation 2, we already have b equals to 12 to the power k. Okay. So, we can write m plus 1 equals to 16 divided by 12 whole to the power k. So, this implies this m plus 1 equals to, by simplifying this fraction, we have 4 by 3 whole to the power k. That is equals to 4 to the power k divided by 3 to the power k. And we have m equals to a by b. So, from equation 1, a equals to 9 to the power k and b equals to 12 to the power k. So, we can write 9 divided by 12 whole to the power k. This is equals to 3 to the power k divided by 4 to the power k. Okay. So, from equation 4, you can see that m plus 1 is equals to 4 to the power k divided by 3 to the power k. So, we can write m equals to 1 by 1 plus m. So, by cross multiplication, we have m multiplied with 1 plus m equals to 1. This is equals to m plus m square minus 1 equals to 0. So, we can write m square plus m minus 1 equals to 0. So, here we have an quadratic equation. In order to find the value of m, we will apply a quadratic formula that is m equals to minus b plus or minus root over b square minus 4ac divided by 2a. So, here value of a equals to 1, b equals to 1 and c equals to minus 1. So, we can write m equals to minus 1 plus or minus root under 1 square minus 4 multiplied with 1 minus 1 divide by 2 multiplied with 1. So, our m equals to minus 1 plus or minus root 5 divided by 2. So, from here we can write m equals to minus 1 minus root 5 divided by 2 or m equals to root 5 minus 1 divided by 2. As we have given a and b are positive integers, so this negative value get discarded. So, we have one and only value that is m equals to root 5 minus 1 divided by 2. 
so we have taken m equals to a by b and our m equals to root 5 minus 1 divided by 2 so what are asked to find we are asked to find b by a so this implies this a by b equals to root 5 minus 1 divided by 2 this implies this b by a e equals to 2 by root 5 minus 1 so this implies this b by a equals to now we'll do rationalization of denominator because we have radical value in our denominator so let's just multiply root 5 plus 1 in numerator and root 5 plus 1 in denominator multiplied with root 5 minus 1 so we have b by a equals to 2 multiplied with root 5 plus 1 divided by root 5 square minus 1 square this equals to 2 root 5 plus 1 divided by 5 minus 1 so this implies this b by a equals to 2 root 5 plus 1 divide by 4 so 2 4 get cancelled out by 2 so we have root 5 plus 1 divide by 2 as our answer i hope you have understood the solution thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel and hit the like button for more such interesting videos thank you